Hey everybody, welcome back to Starfire Gaming. I am Sir Joseph and this is Baldur's Gate 3, which just got released today out of uh, Early Access. So we're going to go ahead and give it a play. So we want to do a new game. <clears throat> well, let's do balanced. Um. All right, opening cinema like. Mind Flayer guy. They only have three fingers. That would be horrific. Yeah, that would be terrible. <clears throat> We'll leave tutorial pop-ups on for now. I mean, I've been through the... I've, I've played a little bit, so... Origin characters. I will play our own character, though. This start is a little bit different here. Race, let's see here, we've got Elf. Tiefling. Drow. Human. Gith Yankee. Dwarf. Half Elf. <coughs> Excuse me, halfling, gnome, there's the dragonborn loading in, well dragonborns look pretty cool. Half orc, alright, let's, first off, All right, so that's male, female. We don't want to be a barbarian. Uh, so we got bard, cleric, druid, ranger, paladin, monk, fighter, rogue, sorcerer, warlock, wizard. All right, so in the Pathfinder one, we played a um, cavalier. I was thinking maybe a paladin, because paladins are cool. Monks are cool. Warlocks are cool. Maybe one of those three. Do 
You know what? I can't figure it out. So we are going to decide, as all true gamers decide anything. We're going to roll the die six. I've got a die bag of dice handy here. All right. I rolled a one, so we're going to play a monk. I like monks. Monks aren't the greatest in D&D, &D, so we'll hopefully they've made some, some slight modifications here to make them better. Uh, let's see here. Um, 17, 14 wisdom, 8 intelligence, 12 strength, 10 charisma. 12, 17, 14, 10, 8, Oh, so stats are going to be the same no matter what we have. As far as our class goes, let's take a look at Dragonborn. Dragonborn is probably a cool. I, I say it, Dragonborn looks cool. I like the way he looks. All right. So a black dragonborn. Can we be a different thing of dragonborn? Or can we only be a black dragon? There we go, sub race. So black, blue, blue. Ooh. Oh, that looks cool. That eh, looks okay. That eh, looks okay. Eh. Eh. Eh, not bad. Silver looks pretty cool. Eh. Silver. Blue. Boy, it's looking like blue. Yeah, we're going to go blue. Blue looks cool. All right, background. Acolyte. Charlatan. Criminal. Entrepreneur. Or entertainer, not entrepreneur. Wow, I can't read. Um, Outlander, Noble, Guild Artisan, Folk Hero, Sage, Soldier, Urchin, Insight Religion, Charlatan, no, 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 kind of like the Outlander. Let's go Outlander. Let's take a look at our stats. We want a monkey with our stats any. Or I guess in this case we would be dragony with our stats. Ha! <laughs> ha! We're a dragon. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah. That, this looks fine to me. All right. Do we have a name place or is that going to be down the road? Well, let's proceed. There we go. We're not going to be Tav. We are going to be Joseph. You need a guardian. Choose one. Oh, we need a guardian. All right. What do we want our guardian to be? We have a drow guardian. Tiefling guardian. Human. Well, let's... One, two, eight. There's ten of them. All 
right. Roll to one. That's a drow, so we're gonna have a drow guardian. Uh, we are waking up from just having had a bug put in our eyeball. A worm. A nasty, icky looking worm. Oh. Got a dead mind flayer. guy's running to ring the bell and I'm like yeah, yeah first off you should have been near the bell but who's not going to notice the giant squid flying over the city destroying towers Now this cinematic looks awesome. Get Yankee riding red dragons. That would have hurt. <laughs> Hitting that water. Ship's taking a beat. Pickpocketing is a quick path to riches.
Ah, that was a bit glitchy. Yeah. Starting standing up like that in the pod. My head. All right. Got some stuff to do. Exploring. Might still be stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. Where the hells are we? Now let me know if his talking is um, high enough volume or not, if I need to increase it. Not everyone made it out alive. It's pretty, pretty light on my side. Let's go into audio. We're going to go ahead and just bring voice all the way up to 100. into your mind a nautiloid hurtling through the plains resplendent with psionic energy a nautiloid that must be what type of ship we're in twelve gold all right let's head back around Let's kind of look around our area here. We got a dead mind flare. Got the nursery. Let's check out the nursery. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Investigate the pool. Skill checks. We have a minus one because we are intelligent as nothing. We passed, though. The casing is fragile. The slightest touch could cause it to crumble. Yeah, let's leave it alone. Is that the pot I came out of? No. All right, let's check out this dead mind flayer. What's hiding here? Earl. Dead. Good. Someone else got out. Oh, we got another chest up here. A hyena ear. Yum. I make potions of speed with it. That's cool. Wow, that bomb is freaking awesome. Jump, 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 jump. Well, there's nothing over here anymore. There used to be something over here. Let's check just a little bit more just to make sure. Yep, nope, nothing over here. All right. I just remember there used to be a, a body or something over there. Jump again. All right. Better not be cursed. Might be other survivors. Hmm. 
Restoration pod. We are not hurt. Oh, what's this? Oh, our flurry of blows. Topple, we are armed with a quarter staff. In the words of the mighty Daffy Duck, it's a buck and a quarter quarter staff. Images of goblins, their habits and histories flash into your mind. All right, we know about goblins. One gold coin from the dead goblin. A schematic of a nautiloid flashes into your mind. Nerves, sinews, as much living being as ship. Evidently, don't do anything. Mind flare horticulture. A thousand years of humanoid history, elves, dwarves, humans, and more flash behind your eyes. to save us from this place. From this place you'll free us. The exposed brain quivers in expectation. Please, before they return. They return. Who am I talking to? A man or a brain? A newborn. Born new from this husk. You realize you're talking to an intellect devourer, a minion of the mind flayers who abducted you. You sound afraid. Why? The enemy. So many enemies. So we could try to save it or just squish it. I think we're gonna squish it. Try not running in the fire, that would be awesome. This... 
You are no thrall. Vlacketh blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. We need to figure out where we are. We can do nothing until we escape. That must be our priority. First, we exterminate the imps. Then we find the helm and take control of the ship. We will address the matter of a cure for this infection once we reach the material plane. That is gruesome. All right, so I, um, I I played, you know, a little bit on the uh... wow. This is different than the the pre-release. It changed things up a little bit from the um, early access. That's kind of cool. Let's go beat up an imp. There we go again. One imp down. Victory awaits. I will not know failure. Two imps down. All the imps. You prove surprisingly adequate in man. This is to the hell. cool that they change these things. I like that. It's not the same. I mean, it's it's fairly the same, but it's not exactly the same. We are gonna have in her I crave blood. loot stuff because we are a monk. And we need to keep looted. our inventory low. So we keep all of our monkey bonuses. Plus two armor class, advantage on dexterity, saving throw, double your movements. That's pretty cool. What lies within? Alright, anything else in this room? Take charge again. Should mind my step. Uh, okay, um, not quite what I was expecting that to be. We're gonna take a little nap here. Ship won't be able to take another dragon attack. We need to get out before it's too late. All right, that did work the way I wanted it to. This is cool. I like that things are different. Auto save. Going into a sphincter. Istic, back. Touch 
nothing without knowing its purpose. Well, the Arcana failed on everything. Push some buttons. See what happens. Push a button. The psionic energy radiates from the prisoners, but they do not react. Time for stragglers. Look for a latch. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? Now look around. There must be some way to open this thing. Try that contraption next to the pod. They did something to it when they sealed me in. Soul appears dormant. Look for a release switch. The mechanisms are completely unrecognizable at first, but then you spy an empty socket. Hit it. Nothing. The console remains dormant. All right. It's in that socket must power this thing. Let's push some more buttons. Restoration pad. I feel better. Push this button. All right, nothing happened. Faint images appear in your mind a brain, a Gip Yankee warrior, and centuries of darkness. Mind flare or an intellect devourer, I mean. I need a quick word. Ah, it said I'm beautiful.
Something good here, I hope. This might unlock those controls next to the pod. All right, rescue the captive. Soul appears dormant. Insert the rune into the socket. The console hums to life. Take a closer look. We did it! Hand on the console. Suddenly, you feel a hideous squirming in your head. The parasite. Then discomfort fades, and another sensation washes over you. Connection. Authority. Will the pod to open? Got a plus two, need a two. I think we're gonna pass this one. You feel the biomechanical brain of the console process your command and yield to it. A shiver runs across your mind. You feel sated. Dangerous company is what you need in a fight. Fair point. Looks like there's plenty of fighting ahead. Let me come with you. We can get off this ship and watch each other's backs along the way. Did you feel what I felt just before? We were in each other's heads. I did. It must be because of those parasites they put in us. But that'll have to wait. Are we going to help each other or not? All right then, let's get going. I'm Joseph. Shadowheart. One moment. What's that? It's nothing. Trust me. Enough of this chatter. We need to get to the helm. Now. She's right. Lead on. All right. Money in an onyx. Another healing pod. We are nearing the helm. Once inside, do as I say. Who put you in charge? I'll trust my own judgment. Kane Yank. 
We all know I'm the Dragon Lord. That means I'm in charge. That and we're the player characters. Ow! Just at the back of his head, he... Assuming his brain sucked out in the process. Lesser Hellsbor. Him. We'll go take out the M. No time for mercy. Taste my fury. Nice hit. Let's see, Shield of Faith, Guiding Bolt, Resistance, Sacred Flame, Charm Person, Disguise Self, Blessing of the Trickster, Guidance, Inflict Wound, Healing Word. Let's do Sacred Flame, that's a cantrip. Ah, he saved. Stay away from the battle. Two things that are way beyond our pay grade. Shadow heart up here. Have to keep going. If this ship hits the ground, we're dead. Ah, I missed. That time I didn't. Wow, the mind flare's getting his butt handed to him. Make way. Strike hard, strike fast. 
Nice hit. The helm's alien there we go. transponder. You've made it in time. <laughs> Web surfaces can entangle you, but they can prevent you from taking falling damage. They're a good spot for a soft landing. Out we go. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Uh, let's orient ourselves. Where did we land? The chaos of the crash site confuses the landscape. You'll need to find a settlement or landmark, and you'll need to do it quickly. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. All right, we have escaped the Nautiloid. All righty, well, we're going to call it here. Thank you guys for watching. I do appreciate it. As always, like, subscribe, and comment. I appreciate that as well. I have been Sir Joseph. You guys are amazing. Until next time, stay safe out there, and I'll talk to you later.